Peggy 3. Um, it's a world tour, uh, contains 35 venues. Uh, and the idea is not only to reflect the fact that it's a global game, but also the different styles of play. So um, a 2v2 match might be played in a very small venue uh, with smaller nets and no goalies. So, you know, it creates a different type of dynamic than a 6v6 match in a, in a, in a tournament type stadium. Uh, or a futsal match, which is 5v5 with no walls. Obviously, that's a very different type of gameplay. We also have uh, different physics of the, of the walls themselves. So if you play within a gym, even within a gym itself, you'll have like a standard brick wall on one side, potentially, and maybe a more of a fenced wall on the other side. And the physics of the, the fence versus brick will play quite differently. The surfaces themselves, between hardwood, turf, um, concrete, uh, just being on a street, you know, they'll play slightly different too. So. You know, we want, really want the venues to be more than just kind of a window dressing. If we're going to create all these venues, we want them to offer something to the fans, uh, an actual element of the gameplay itself. So, you know, it's one of the cool things we have is not just the number of venues, but the fact that they affect the way you play the game. You know, we created this kind of a world where you can kind of go in, you can submerse yourself within the street football uh, kind of lifestyle um, by traveling the world, playing in up to 35 different venues. Um, that do truly span the world, venues that kind of help us really demonstrate that this is a world game.